Hello! Today, we'll be showing you how to replace the motherboard in an ASUS Chromebook Flip C100PA. First, you will need a few tools. An anti-static mat is recommended to prevent electrostatic discharge, which can damage electronic parts. A small, magnetic tip Phillips head screwdriver will be necessary for this replacement. You will also need a T5 screwdriver during this replacement process. You will need thermal paste during this replacement. A spudger will also come in handy during this replacement. You can use either plastic or metal, whichever you prefer. If you have tweezers, you might also want to have them handy, as they may be useful when dealing with small parts. The first step will be to remove the four rubber feet on the bottom cover. Next, you will remove the five screws from beneath the rubber feet. You will use the Phillips head screwdriver to remove these screws. There is one screw from under the front right rubber foot and two screws from beneath each of the two rear rubber feet. Be sure to make note of where each screw that you remove from the bottom cover came from because there are a few different sizes of screws. Now, you will remove the nine bottom cover screws. You will use the T5 screwdriver to remove these screws. Eight of these screws are the same size, but there is one in the rear middle that is longer. Be sure to make note of which one it is and where it goes for the reassembly process. Next, you will use your spudger to carefully pry the palm rest assembly apart from the bottom cover. Now, you will disconnect the touchpad cable and the keyboard cable on the palm rest assembly from the motherboard. The palm rest assembly is now removed. Now, you will disconnect the DC jack cable and the battery cable from the motherboard. Next, you will disconnect the LCD cable from the motherboard. Now, you will disconnect the motherboard to powerboard cable from the motherboard. Next, you will disconnect the digitizer board cable from the motherboard. Now, you will disconnect the two Wi-Fi antenna cables from the motherboard. Next, you will disconnect the speaker cable from the motherboard. Now, you will remove the four speaker screws and then remove the speakers.
Next, you will remove the five motherboard screws. You can now remove the motherboard. Now you will remove the two heat sink screws from the motherboard and then remove the heat sink. The first step in the installation of your replacement motherboard will be to apply thermal paste to the CPU on the motherboard. Now you will set the heat sink into place on the motherboard and replace the two heat sink screws. Now, you will set the motherboard into place and replace the five motherboard screws. Next, you will set the speakers into place and replace the four speaker screws. Now, you will reconnect the speaker cable to the motherboard. Next, you will reconnect the two Wi-Fi antenna cables to the motherboard. Now, you will reconnect the digitizer board cable to the motherboard. Next, you will reconnect the LCD cable to the motherboard.
Now, you will reconnect the motherboard to powerboard cable to the motherboard. Next, you will reconnect the DC jack cable and the battery cable to the motherboard. Now you will reconnect the touchpad cable and the keyboard cable on the palm rest assembly to the motherboard. Next, you will snap the palm rest assembly back into place on the bottom cover. Now, you will replace the nine bottom cover screws. You will use the T5 screwdriver for these screws. Remember that the one longer screw goes in the middle rear of the bottom cover. The final step will be to replace the five screws from beneath the rubber feet on the bottom cover and then replace the four rubber feet. You have now successfully replaced the motherboard in your ASUS Chromebook Flip. Good job!